Hello. Um, today I'm going to be talking about um, gentlemen prefer pl blondes and that versus the birdcage. So to start off with how the roles discussed in the chapter reading relate to these two films over the weekend, um, the roles discussed, oh my gosh, I just wrote down at the same time, but it relates because we watched, uh, the films we watched, they each use like a large number of stereotypes and particularly like stereotypes about women. Um, I will note that there was like, both these films break from stereotypes we typically see, but there's also ways they kind of like align with it. Um, and I don't think use of stereotypes necessarily makes a film bad. I think it really depends on how they use them. And we're gonna get to that in a different, varies on. Um, so I, well, I would say gentlemen prefer, ugh, oh my gosh, that's a hard thing to say. Gentlemen prefers, prefer blondes. It's definitely very feminist for its time. Like I was watching that and I was like, man, this is, this is nice. They're not pitting the women against each other. They're showing like they are intellectual. Like they're trying to portray, um, not Dorothy. Um, I'm blanking on her name. I'm sorry. But Marilyn Monroe, that's every time she's on screen, like it's Marilyn. Um, it's like she's clearly not dumb. Like in her position in society, it makes sense why money is important because goodness knows it's not like they can make their money, like enough money on their own. Um, but the way, anyways, the way they also, they're still sort of feminist fatales in the sense, like, for example, Dorothy's a seductress, um, and like she, we see her like using her looks and stuff, but I don't think that, that's just kind of like where she would fall with the typical stereotypes. And then in the in the birdcage, um, while it also like has some stereotypes about gay people, um, they also like show stereotypes of women because um, the he's the stereotypic wife is played by a man. Um, Albert basically puts on this whole show of what he knows about the stereotypes of women and literally fools the senator. The senator is even like, "This is my kind of woman," and I'm like. It's, it's, it's ironic um, and funny, um, but I think that's also where like stereotypes of women even come to that movie. Anyways, these are both like really interesting watches. I, I never sat down and watched Gentlemen Prefer Blondes and I'm like, oh, this is a, this is a good movie. The songs are really catchy, um, but I hope you all have a good day.